Okay, you guys. Good evening. So we wanted to talk to y'all a little bit about leadership and moving forward, but also I wanted to open because I wanted to talk to y'all a little bit about my journey with leadership, specifically how it's taken me a lot longer of a time than, well, maybe it's, it's kind of average. I guess in our, a lot of people's eyes, you think people come on as a coach. It takes them one to two years they're at the top, they're five star, they're already at leadership retreat. And I wanted you to know that it's not always the case. Um, for me, it took six years and it could take longer for some people, but I wanted this call to start off with like encouragement and hopefully to let you know that it's okay to, it's okay to go at your own pace. So first off, Leader Retreat, you guys, was amazing. We were all about the reels and stories and like post. I think when you get three Enneagram threes together, I was talking to my sister about this. She was like, oh my gosh, like I just got off of Nadley and she was like, y'all were like on it. I was like, oh yeah, I think we just had a to-do list and we checked it off and you put a bunch of threes together and we will check off that to-do list. Um, but Beachbody no doubt spoils you at the retreat. They have, it's at an incredible resort. You have live workouts with the best super trainers and Sean T was up there. Anyway, there was like a breakfast spread and lunches and dinners and opening and closing ceremonies. Um, after your workout, they had Shakeology and recover on like a silver platter. They just go all out like Beachbody does it so well. They had a keynote speaker from Tony Robbins team, which was incredible. They had top coaches who spoke about different ways they're working on their business to move it forward. And we'll talk more about that on more calls, but overall it was just a great team bonding experience. And, um, Rachel and Jessica and Raquel, we couldn't stop saying everyone on team VIP deserves to be here next year. There is no reason. And we thought about you guys every step of the way. We're like, we want team VIP to be so big and represent and just be here next year. And I want to be open and honest with you guys about my journey in qualifying for leadership because every year since 2016, my team has been setting the goal to be a five-star diamond team and qualify for a leadership retreat. And every year, 2016, 2017, 2018, 2019, 2020, the goal was set and the goal was missed, okay? So I actually did a post five years ago yesterday. I was looking at my memories and I like, it was like my face and I was like, we are on the way. We're going to be a five-star diamond team. We're going to be elite. And I wasn't wrong. Like we were, we were right there. And I was actually talking to Mary Day, which was um, my mentor. So when you become a diamond, you get assigned to a corporate mentor and definitely take advantage of that. And she was on board. She was like, this is your plan. This is what you're doing. And it just wasn't in our cards to happen that year or the year after that, or the year after that, or the year after that, and, and the year after that. So after five years of setting the goal and missing the goal, my question for you is, would you stick around in this business? Like, would you want to quit? Because those feelings of self-doubt will start to set in. And I'm sure you have been there. I am sure no matter how long or how little you've been a coach, those feelings of I'm not good enough. What am I even doing this for? What is the point? Am I a good leader? Am I a good coach? Why am I even setting these goals when year after year I am failing and I'm missing them? Um, does that sound familiar to y'all? Like, I don't know if you can relate, but would you stick around if you missed a goal for five years in a row? Um, but what if I told you, like, I feel like now that, um, I finally hit that goal, right. And not that that's the end at all. It just took six years, but looking back and I realized that there is like a higher, a higher plan to all this. So what if I told you there was like a higher plan, that there's a reason and a purpose for why you aren't hitting that goal yet. Maybe it's because you're mentally not ready for a big ass team and God is still preparing your heart and your mind to take on that challenge. Maybe it's because you haven't read that life-changing book about leadership that you've been meaning to read and it's, your, it's in your Amazon like cart and you just aren't ready and you're just not doing it. But what if it's going to change the course of your coaching career? Maybe it's because of that. Or maybe it's because you've said, you haven't said yes, to that push coach 
that you've been looking at and being like, man, I need, you know, I have my upline, which is awesome, but I, I feel like I need more of like a coach and mentor by my side that um, maybe you've been thinking about that and you haven't yet and you've been meaning to. And once you do, you have some eye opening realizations about the limitations you've been setting around your business. Or maybe it's because you've simply not been consistent enough in your business and you know that you know exactly what you need to do, but you haven't been serious enough to put it into action. Or maybe it's because you haven't gone in like truly all into your nutrition and you and your workouts. And somehow in the back of your head, you're doubting all of this. You're doubting network marketing. You're doubting that portion fix works. You're doubting that home workouts work. Because really what it takes, and I always say this, like if you cut me open, I bleed beach body blue. Like I know for sure if I wasn't, if I wasn't coaching, I would be in love uh, with the home workouts because I know they work and I know our nutrition is flawless because I have been there. I have done that. I was a binge eater, yo-yo dieter on to the next thing. And I've been doing this for six years. What on the same plan? That's absolutely insane. Mind you, I've been like to be and portion fix and all that, but with beach body and knowing that it works, or maybe it's because the coaches that have helped you get to diamond or one star or even two star, maybe they quit. And, but what if you help them find their path to their next big purpose in life? How awesome that you were that avenue to help them to their next bigger and best thing, that you were a part of their journey. Every single win and loss that happens in this business doesn't happen to you. It happens for you. And there is a reason behind that. You have no control over how or when it's going to happen, but you do have control over your mindset and the thoughts you create around this business and the actions that you take or don't take. For example, if you're constantly beating yourself in your up in your head and you're having these mean girl, mean guy thoughts and saying that you're not good enough, you're not a good coach, you're not a good leader, those things start affecting you big time. And until you, until you change your thoughts and how you speak to yourself, nothing else will change. And I also want to be real with y'all um, and tell you that I've had to rebuild my two star three times. That means I've had six diamonds go in and out, in and out. Some have quit, some are still there, some are in and out, but that's real and that's normal and it happens because sometimes when we get in this business, we think it just goes like this. You have along your emeralds and you have your emeralds and you are now a diamond and then you get a diamond and they become a diamond and they're in it forever and that's just not the case. And that, I wanna tell you that it's okay and that it's normal. And the team that got me to five star and our team to five star is not the team that's going to get us to five star next year. It's just not. And I just want to be open and honest that all those things are normal, normal. And yes, some people come out of the gate and hit it for the first time and go up to the top. Um, and God, please bring me all those coaches. But sometimes that's not just, that's not normal. So if you're sitting here saying you don't have the team to get you to five star, me neither. But you and I both know it's absolutely possible. It takes focus. It takes setting goals, implementing those actions to help you get to those goals. So how I have changed my mindset to keep me motivated throughout all the missed goals is focusing on what's working and what brings you joy in this business. I think it comes back to why do you do this business? What brings you the most joy? And I also has changed. Um, What's changed is like the thought process around this business for me in the past six years. And that has a ton to do with personal development. So if you are not reading, doing podcasts, listening to the national wake up call, feeding your mind every single day with personal development, those mean girl, mean guy thoughts are going to consume your mind and just beat you down. So we are going to do a little activity. So get out a pen and a paper, just you can have, if you have a little journal beside you, um, if you have your planner, maybe flip to the back where it says notes, but get out a piece of, piece of paper and a pen, okay? I'm going to set the timer for three minutes. And we did this, we kind of did this a little bit at the leadership retreat where you write down your thoughts and you continue to write for three minutes without stopping. So you get a lot of thoughts out on a piece of paper. Okay, so I'm gonna set the timer. And so um, what we're going to do is 
we're going to write what brings you joy in this business. Okay. So what brings you joy? So for me, I wrote down, I thrive off of a team. You guys, I love every single one of y'all. I love our group messages. I love our pods. Even if I don't respond right away, I love them. I love just working with my challengers and I love this community. And I think the live events are so powerful because we haven't had one in so long that we forget how powerful they are. Um, another one could be you get a transformation from being a beach body coach and you get to showcase that with accountability. Um, another one could be um, income and how it doesn't have a cap and how even if you're making $50 a week or $5,000 a month, that that is impactful for you and your family and for your life. So I'm going to set a timer for three minutes and don't stop writing and you're going to say what brings you joy in this business and go. Okay, you guys, we're going to stop. And if you want, you can add it to the chat. Um, not a big deal if you just want to keep it to yourself because you probably wrote down a lot of words. Okay, next one and last one. Um, we are going to write three goals. Okay, so three goals. I want you to write um, number one, your end of year goal. Okay, end of year goal. Number two, write these down, your goal by summit. And number three, your goal by the end of next year. Okay, so say maybe you are an Emerald coach and you're like, I don't really know what Diamond is, but I know I want that by you know the end of the year or maybe it's spring break. I want three goals. It doesn't matter exactly where they are, but that's how I'm doing my business is um, for me, it is the bonus during this last quarter getting the two-star bonus so getting my second business center back to diamond and then by next by summit which also is qualification around qualification for leadership retreat so if you if everyone should have leadership retreat on their goals uh, because i am right there with you going to be doing it with a brand new team i mean a lot of the same team but oh, some new diamonds as well um qualifying for leadership leadership retreat. And then by the end of the next year, getting my second business center opening two star to open a third. So right, two minutes to do that. And whenever you are done, I need you to text your upline, 
text her upline, take a minute to do so and share with them what are your three goals end of the year by summit and end of next year i'm going to set a timer for one minute so for those that are asking in the chat um summit will be in st louis in july 2022 and if you are a success starter meaning that you hit success club three new people in your three out of your first six months, you'll earn a free ticket to that event. And Leah, the, the it was goals by summit and the other goal is by the end of the year, by yeah, the end of this year. So by the end of December, that's kind of your pit stop. And then July of 2022, which will be summit. And then the third one is end of 2022, correct? Or yes, correct. Okay, and once you have that done, text your upline, write it down. Um, I wrote down five star diamond coach for three years straight every single day. And I obviously I thought I was going to hit it the first year, but what you say and what you do matter. So if I encourage you to do anything, it's to write down those goals every single morning, whenever you're drinking your energized, doing your personal development, after you do your workout, make sure you have your goals present and make sure you talk about your goals with your team, with your upline and repeat it every single day. Okay. I am going to pass along. I said I was going to be 10 minutes. That was 18. So sorry. Okay. Raquel. Take it over. Um, I don't really want to follow you after that. So I feel like we're done here. <laughs> it was so good. I don't think there's enough talked about when you don't hit goals and how do you keep going um, and how special that is. There's a Kristen Boss podcast um, that I'll share in the team page in the event. Um, I shared with some of my coaches uh, last week because Rachel shared it with us and it's really, really good. And it talks about, you know, how to not compare and how to keep going. It was really, really good. But Laura, thank you for that. I'm going to totally change gears and we're going to talk about body with the I, which is Beachbody On Demand Interactive. Just by a quick raise of hands, who has gone and tried any of the body workouts yet? Cool. So here's how I feel like this works. We have people that fall in under one of two camps. One, you are somebody who follows a workout calendar to AT, do not mess it up, cannot waver off of this. And so it's really hard for you to venture off body. Who's that? That like has to follow a calendar to a T, right? And then there's other people like myself who I say I have fitness ADD. I can follow a calendar. I'm good for 21 days. I'm even good for 30 Six weeks is like my max of what I can follow. And that's just who I am because I get fitness ADD. So here's what I want you to know. If you're somebody who follows a calendar, I'm excited for you, but I'm going to make you get uncomfortable and say, I need you to go try some body workouts so that you can start learning what they look like. Maybe if there's a cardio day, let me just tell you, let me put my personal trainer hat on. You can swap a cardio in your plan for a cardio on body and the world will continue. Okay. I just want to like give you permission that you can do that. Maybe there's like a rest day, go try a yoga, um, on body instead of that, like relaxation, stretching or what a mobility day. Okay. I just encourage you, or maybe you have a day off and go try one of the uh, other workouts because it is incredible. Now, if you're somebody like me, who's fitness ADD and you're kind of in between programs or you feel like, I can't do 21 day fix extreme one more time at all. Like 21 day fix extreme was the one I came in with. Um, plyo fix challenge was like the hardest workout. I was like, okay, I'm sold. But I sometimes just get bored. So body right now for me and my season of life is amazing. I come from a gym background. I was a trainer. I was a group fitness instructor and I love home workouts. Beachbody home workouts have been my life for almost seven years as of December 21st. But this brings me back to the energy of a live class of an instructor that you like love to go to their class. You're not sure why you like them, but there's this intangible charismatic thing that you're like, Oh my gosh, Lee Jimenez on body is my boy. Like I cannot get enough of him. Eric Thompson, my husband likes the Eric Thompson strength class. Um, obviously if you love Shanti, you're going to love Shanti on body because he brings the energy. So here's what I want to encourage you to do. 
One, if you haven't tried those workouts, please go try them. Try different trainers, try different workouts so that when you can confidently talk about what we have to offer. It is our job as coaches to go first. And when, co when you have your customers being like, ooh, you know, what workout should I try? That you have a trainer that you're like, ooh, you know what? I know what you kind of like. Like you really love like the muscle burns fat. I really think you'd like Jenny Jousian. She's like kind of has that same vibe as like Megan Davies. You should go try her workout, okay? So our job is to really go on and try the different workouts. But I want you to know this is gonna open up a whole new opportunity for us, for people who love the idea of a live workout. I haven't got onto one that's fully live, but I watched recorded and it feels like it's live. This is gonna open up so much for us because this is the people that love going to the gym, but maybe they're in a season of life where they can't. The idea of me going to a gym right now is comical. Like I just, I don't think I would do it. I, I just wouldn't, but I love the energy and I feel like this is gonna really fit avoid that beach body has been missing so but we have to share it with excitement i want you this week to go and show what does it look like because i think sometimes too people don't really grasp like what it okay you're saying it's a live workout but you're at home in your loft like nothing really looks that different show them what it looks like maybe even have the sound of what the trainer i'm pointing out because that's where my tv is what the trainer sounds like the music is awesome like we literally get pop top 40 music and I am very musically driven. A lot of my workouts that I do at home with Beachbody because I said I've done 21 day fix extreme so much. I literally know every motivational thing Autumn is gonna say. So I've been to the point where I'm like, I just don't even listen to her and I'm listening to my own music. But with body, the music is like pumping. Today I did a Mwala and it was like, yes, here for this. So I want you to go on. I want you to encourage your current customers. If they have a nutrition plus membership, which most, a lot of them do have them tap into this. Maybe they haven't fully gotten the benefit of nutrition plus, but have them go and log in and try these different workouts. I'm telling you, I have yet, I have yet to have somebody that I haven't suggested they go try it that hasn't come back to me and like loved it. They're like, oh my gosh, this is going to be a game changer for me because we all do. We all do get in certain ruts. And you know, sometimes for me, I'll be honest, 645 kind of is a lot for me right now in this season of life. Like 45 minutes was really being hard for me. And then I would get behind and then Fortunately, it's my job and I have to show up, but there's also that part of me that if I get behind, I feel like I'm failing. And then it's like, well, shoot, do I go back and restart week five? Cause I'm kind of like behind, like, what do I do? The cool thing about this is I really feel like it's going to help people feel successful. My, I'm like, my goal, just do four workouts a week. Just go on, log into body. I just want you to move your body. And then that gets people who are just in a busy season of life that maybe can't follow a calendar perfectly, that'll get them moving. I know Rachel um, and Jess and I, we talk a lot about like cycle syncing for females, working out around your menstrual cycle. Um, you know, high intensity cardio, probably not the best thing to be doing during that phase of the month for you. But what's cool is I can log on and find a workout that works for me in my cycle. Now, not everybody's going to do that, but that's really kind of picking up steam. Um, so I just want you to know, I don't know if you can tell my excitement. I'm obsessed with body literally obsessed, could not be more excited. This will be a game changer. I just want you to go and try it try different workouts, try different trainers and show it. Now, we probably need to do another call on this. I can post it in the live event, but um, I watched a training on it on like, okay, why do I need to be excited about body? This was even before I tried the workouts. Financially speaking, this can 3X your business income. So y'all know I love the compensation plan. You know, I love, this is a business at the end of the day. I'm here to be profitable. I'm obsessed with body is bringing fitness wise, but I'm telling you right now with the bod and the body commissions, this has the ability to three X your income. So this is a pivotal moment in which you can jump on this. And this is like, this is something that we've never done, but you can jump on it and you will feel the effects or you can sit back and just kind of like watch, which either way is fine. No judgment either way. But I'm telling you, if you join this to be a profitable business, this has the ability to do that. I took some screenshots from the call that I did. Actually, I'm just gonna post a call, but also some screenshots of what the numbers look like. I'm somebody who needs to see numbers. I need to see it on paper. I need to see what the opportunity is. And it's written out, if you help three people a month with that success club, that's like our 
baseline metric of moving your business forward. Here's what it looks like in year one, year two, year three, year four, year five on commissions for bod and body. You have to have beach body on demand to have body. If you're hitting success club 10, here's what the commissions look like at the end of year one, year two, year three, year four, year five. Okay. And it is staggering the difference that bod plus body will make. So I will post that in the event page of this, but I just want you to know, this is so exciting on so many reasons. We're going to be able to help so many more people, other people that had the stigma that home workouts aren't their vibe. They're going to be able to join us and be blown away by it. And on we also, because our income grows with impact, we're going to be able to impact so many more people. And in turn, our income really has so much more potential for growth. Um, I'll stop talking. I could literally talk about this all day. If you need an idea of what workout to do, I just told you I love me some Lee Jimenez. Eric Thompson is great. Jenny Jalcian. You can't go wrong. We obviously know we like Amwala. We like Joel. We like Megan Davies. We like Autumn. We know them, but there are some new faces in the mix that I'm low-key obsessed with. Okay. Jess, Rach, I'm going to hand it over to y'all. I think I talked too much. I don't really have anything else to add to that other than it's try it. You get it first. Find out why you, what you get out of it. And then as you're sharing about it, like speak to the need and the problem that it can solve for other people. I'm very big into cycle syncing. I personally think that everyone should be doing it for your health. Um, and it is more challenge. It is challenging to do with programs. Um, this will be, we'll have a cycle singing calendar, um, that people can use once, once we kind of understand what each type of workout fits with each type of phase, like what exactly body burn crush really is, you know, that sort of thing. Um, and that will be such an incredible resource that you'll have, um, to offer, um, your clients who are menstruators in their reproductive years. Um, and I've done, I've only done Lee's workouts and Shanti's. And then this past week, um, we did two of Shanti's workouts on went Thursday and then Friday morning. And he did his body burn crush. The music was, I've literally never had so much fun working out. The music was on fire. The energy was the highest energy that's ever been at any live beach body workout. And then I did the 4 p.m. body burn crush today that Sean T did, and it was also really awesome. The music's really good. I know maybe if you have done some of the workouts, like I know on my Apple TV, I don't get the audio yet, uh, the music yet, so I have to stream it from my iPad. Um, but all of that stuff is getting worked out. And I know Carl said this past week that they are working so freaking hard at getting body launched as soon as possible. Raquel, you didn't mention the body week, the, uh, the premiere week, right? Yes, I did not talk about that. The first week of November. So this is something to add to your calendar. Starting on Monday, November 1st is going to be body premiere week. All week long, there's going to be like celebrity sightings in the podcast. I don't know exactly what that means, but those were Carl's words. Um, there's going to be a ton of prizes and tons of different workouts available that week. So I imagine that body actually launches hopefully before that. I think they were aiming for the 20th of October, but there's still no official release date on that yet. But try it in the month of October so that you can start sharing about it and creating some excitement and so that you can start speaking confidently about the problems it can help people solve, why other people would love it, who should try it to, so that people can get plugged in by that first week, before that first week in November, so that they can experience Premier Week. I'm sure there'll be more information to come about um, what all is going to be available in that week. Oh, you're right. I bet Lizzo is going to be on it. That's a good, that's a good guess, Caitlin. All right, Jessica, anything? Okay, we are, since we are right at time, we're going to move to recognition, but quickly before we do that, as of um, now, all challenge packs are now called total solution packs. So just in case you did not see that change in your online office, it's exactly the same thing. It's still offering the total solution. It's just no longer called challenge, which I love because it really 
Total Solution is such better verbiage for what we offer now. Um, secondly, Super Saturdays are going to be happening the weekend of the 15th, 16th, 17th. I might have those days wrong, but it's that Friday, Saturday, Sunday. The only one that I see in Texas is happening in Dallas. I don't know about anywhere else. I know there's one happening in Florida. I know there's one happening somewhere up on the East Coast, but we don't have a ton, like if you're local to us. Um, but for everybody else, look for your, you can hop on the website and you can look for the one that's closest to you. I do know that they will 99% chance offer it virtually as well, just with everything going on. Leadership was offered virtually. I have no doubt that they'll also offer Super Saturday. Um, yes, or go up and see Kristen in Dallas. She'll have some mountains that'll be ready and blue for you. Um, nothing good close to Angela either. Okay. Um, any other questions, comments, or concerns before we hit recognition? Speak now or forever hold your peace. Okay, great. All right, so wanted to shout out everyone who achieved Success Club in the month of September. Big congrats to Angela for leading our team at 16 points, Leah with Success Club 12, and both Raquel and Stephanie uh, locking in Success Club 10. Um, Laura, Brooke, myself, Denise, who was a new coach, Lori and Jessica, all um, with Success Club 8. And then Erica, Jackie, Kristen, McNair, Christina, Caitlin, uh, Leah, Jamie, Jen, uh, oh, and, uh, and Jamie, sorry, no, ending at Caitlin there, um, locking in Success Club club five plus logging in uh, six points and then big congrats to those of y'all with points on the board so far this month Laura and Angela both have four points and then Isabel Robert Jessica Caitlin Nicole Erica Steph Melanie and probably Stephanie too all with two points so every time if you're a new coach every time that you help one person gets set up with either Shakeology on Home Direct or Energize and Recover on Home Direct or the total solution pack, you will get two success club points. The goal is always to help at least three brand new customers a month. You will be earning at least $150 in retail commission, getting your product paid for and um, earning additional commission on top of that. And if you do, if you hit success club in three out of your first six months, like Raquel mentioned, you will earn a, or somebody else maybe, in this call, earn a free ticket to Summit next um, July, as well as an opportunity to be in a Beachbody test group. And it's just a good indication, a good goal for you to set every single month, no matter if you've hit it last month or not, to always be working towards that goal and beyond so that your business is moving forward and you're really building an impactful business that helps other people get the best results possible. All right, that is all we have. Oh, awesome, it's gonna be Emerald on Thursday. All right, that's all we have for tonight. We will see y'all on the social. Hopefully it's not down tomorrow. Have a great rest of your night, bye.